Good morning everyone, long time no see. I've been horrible about uploading lately, but as you will probably see in this video, school is really ramping up. I'm basically in the first semester of my junior year, even though I've been here as long as a senior. Um, if you haven't heard, I did an engineering co-op. I'll link some videos about that up here and down in the description. But regardless, I'm basically in my third year of school and things are really ramping up. And I have a bunch of work to get done today, um, but I still plan on going out tonight. So I'm going to go to a coffee shop. That way I am not tempted to get back in bed and go to sleep. Um, I am kind of already dressed. Like I said, I'm going out tonight. I'm just wearing this sweater. Ignore my messy mirror and messy room. We're gonna pretend like that's not there. Um, and some leggings and these boots from Target, which are super old, but have been holding up really well in this rain. And I have this little heart necklace on that my sister got me. Um, so yeah, I am going to grab a couple of things together and then we're going to head out. It's raining. So I am back from the coffee shop. Sorry I didn't get too much footage. It got insanely crowded when I got there. I got the last table in the whole place. And it was just really uncomfortable and kind of impossible to film without being up in everybody else's business. And it eventually calmed down, of course, as soon as I decided to head out. I ordered a sandwich to go and came back home. And I'm gonna eat it real quick, do a little bit more work, and then get ready to go out. But first, my sweet mom mailed me a package, so I'm going to open it and see what is in here. It looks like some Halloween goodies. It's candy! Aww! This is so cute! Look at this little bag. There's some Hershey's and Reese's. All very frightening. Love it. Thanks mom. Hi everyone. So it is currently Sunday. I ended up going out last night and then um, got up this morning and met a friend and went to church. I just dropped her off and I am ooh, blocking the camera and I just got some Starbucks. I'm gonna go home and get started on this afternoon's uh, work. This morning I did a little bit of reading for one of my non-engineering classes and then this afternoon I'm going to continue to work on that as well as a couple of other projects. I am back in my favorite attire which is a sweatshirt and some shorts and I am going to drink my coffee. I got a croissant as well. I'm going to eat that real quick and then um, get to work. It is a, a pretty gloomy day outside. It's not raining or anything. It's just really cloudy and a little chilly which is the perfect weather to stay inside and get some stuff done. So I'm gonna eat real quick and then get set up and get to work. Here is the to-do list for today. My whiteboard's a little dirty. Um, I accidentally left it for several months with some writing on it before I erased it again. Um, but besides all my school stuff, the only other thing I gotta do is laundry. So I'll probably get that load started actually before I sit down and work on stuff. Um, that is heat transfer homework. I have homework due on Wednesday. Um, it's currently Sunday. I have a design project due on Wednesday for my separations class. Um, we're designing a distillation column um, and just kind of playing around with ChemCAD, which is the Chemi kind of Unidops software. And then I have organic chemistry lab. Um, our sixth experiment lab report is due, not this coming Tuesday, but the next Tuesday, but our fall break is coming up. So I wanna go ahead and get that done. That way I don't have to worry about it over the break. Then I have a, um, a book to read for an honors college class I'm taking. Um, and then for one of my other classes, I think we have a take home exam to do. He hasn't really been clear about when the due date is, so I might work on that if I get to it. And then for Organic Chemistry Lab, 
the seventh experiment, which again doesn't take place this week, but the next, um, I have to do the pre-lab for that. couple hours later and I am starting the Idrisomi set up the fourth problem from my heat transfer homework and I couldn't figure out the first problem so I moved on and did the next two and now I'm on the fourth one. There's only eight problems so I'm about what two-thirds of the way done now. Um, so I got a good start on it. It probably shouldn't have taken me as long as it did. I did take a couple breaks. I follow the Pomodoro method when I study so I have this little website, it's called Tomato Timer Up. Um, I also have an app on my phone, but that's what I'm using to film, so I couldn't use that today. Um, but basically, you can start this 25 minute timer and it goes and then we'll let you know when it's up. And at that point, I start a short break for five minutes and I get up and that's when I was switching out my laundry, I cleaned my bathroom, and usually my breaks go longer than five minutes and sometimes I work longer than 25 minutes. But the goal is to just break it up so that you are more efficient while you're working and not just dragging things out. I find it a lot easier to get stuff done when I say, okay, all you gotta do is 25 minutes and then it's time for a break. And I end up getting on a roll and I can work faster than or longer than that. Um, but I still try and take the breaks to keep my brain fresh. And during those breaks, it's also really important not to just get on your phone and sit there. I like to get up, um, do laundry, clean, maybe stretch, um, switch assignments. I don't know, something that kind of gives your brain something else to do and isn't totally mindless. Um, it's good to get up and move around a little bit. I can link a few videos down below that I found helpful um, about the Pomodoro Technique method um, if you wanna check it out for yourself. I think it's been super helpful as an engineering student with a lot of work to really uh, manage my time a lot better. So now I think I'm going to put this up. Unfortunately, I didn't get to any of my other engineering assignments, but I got a good start on this. I am going to uh, check in with some people about plans for tonight and then um, sit down and probably read this book for a few minutes because I have to get started on the report about the book eventually. Uh, and I got to read the book to do that.
gonna go ahead and wrap this up. It's now about four o'clock in the afternoon on this fine Sunday. And I got a lot of reading done. I think I just read about 40 pages. Um, I'm trying to pay specific attention since I do have to actually write a report on this and it's not just for fun. Um, so I got a good 40 pages in. I think it's only a 200, 300 word book or page book. So it shouldn't take me too much longer to finish it. So the rest of this day is just gonna be me getting ready for the week. Like I said, fall break is this upcoming weekend, so I gotta pack and plan for all of that. But thank you guys so much for tuning into this video. I hope this was an enjoyable study with me. Um, comment any questions below you have um, about being a chemical engineering student. I did do a Q&A about six months ago, so I'd love to do an updated one. If you'd like to watch that, I will link it down below. But yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm hoping I can find a more consistent upload schedule, but school is just crazy. I'm spending almost every day doing at least three to four, probably more hours of homework. Um, so thank you for your patience while I work through all of my schoolwork, but I hope to see you guys again soon.